and a happy Christmas Eve to you all. I'm Nick, the Rector. This is Karen, one of our preachers. And just in case you thought there wasn't going to be any form of a crib service tonight, then you're totally wrong, because they are, but it will be videoed and on Facebook as well and on the parish website. And what we have before you tonight has been put together by various members of the community and a number of youngsters from the community as well. So thank you for all of your great efforts. And don't worry because we've included all your favourite bits of the normal crib service. We will be singing Away in a Manger where there will be a montage of all the wonderful photographs that have been contributed to us. And of course, we will be singing the Christmas Okie Koki. So do join in at home and sing along with us. Absolutely, quite right. But here we go. Are you ready to begin, everybody? Our story begins a really long time ago. Before toys, before animals, before birds and dinosaurs and many years before coronavirus. Our story starts before humans like you and me, before shepherds, before wise men. So long ago, it was even before your grandma or your great grandma. Wow, God had made the world and humans. But the humans, like you and me, said mean things and they weren't very nice and they didn't listen to God either. And in order to be friends again, God had a plan. And his plan was to send a very special young man. So our story begins with a young girl named Mary. Many years ago, there lived a girl whose name was Mary. She was young and beautiful and would soon be married to a man named Joseph. One day, God sent an angel to Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Do not be afraid, for you have found favour with God. Not had any visitors since March. The angel explained that Mary would have a baby and that she should call him Jesus. About that time, Caesar Augustus ordered everyone to travel from their hometown to be counted, so Joseph and Mary had to travel from Nazareth to Bethlehem on a donkey. Mary was very nearly ready to have her baby, but there were no rooms at the inns because they'd all shut under Tier 2 regulations. But a kind innkeeper said they could sleep in the stable. Please help, my wife is about to have a baby too. I'm sorry, but unless you've booked in advance, we can't accommodate you. But we do have a stable you could use. In the stable that night, amongst the hay and animals, Mary gave birth to a son, wrapped him in a blanket, and laid him in a manger. In a nearby field, there were some shepherds who were furloughed. As they gathered around for a chat, they saw a beautiful angel. Today a saviour has been born for you. Many angels appeared as the shepherds ran to Bethlehem and found Mary and Joseph and the baby lying in the manger. <gasps> oh. 
Also that night, a new star appeared in the sky. Far away, three wise men knew something special had happened, but they didn't have Google Maps or Saturn Instead, they followed the bright shining star, which led them to the stable in Bethlehem, where they had to quarantine for 14 days. Follow me! When they saw Jesus, they worshipped him and gave him gifts of gold, frankincense and myrrh. And so ends the story of the first Christmas. Jesus was born. God was made man and lived among us. But that was only the, the beginning of the story. You remember at the beginning, I told you that God had a plan to send us a very special young man. Well, baby Jesus grew up into a boy and into a man and did amazing things. By his teaching and by the way he lived, he showed us how we should lead our lives on earth. Baby Jesus and Jesus the man were the exact same Jesus in God's rescue plan. And by his death, he made it possible for us to join them in heaven. And this all began when an angel came to Mary all those years ago. Normally, at this point in our crib service, We'd invite all the children in the congregation, many of whom will have come dressed up as shepherds, wise men, angels, and we'd invite them to the front here where Nick and I are sitting to form a tableau of the nativity scene. But this year instead, we ask you to send in pictures of yourselves dressed as nativity characters. And so now we'd like to share them with you. And thank you to all of those of you who have actually sent pictures in to be displayed tonight. But please sing with us, Away in a Manger.
Our Sunday Club have written prayers for the service this evening and we're going to listen to them now. We pray for all countries affected by coronavirus, illness, poverty and fighting. Guide those who lead to find answers to the problems and help the countries to heal and move forward. Amen. For our teachers who keep us safe at school, help them have a fun Christmas too. We remember all the people who help others, help us to remember to be kind to everyone. Amen. We remember everyone who has died. We look after them when you're in heaven and be with their family and friends who have missed their Amen. For all the doctors, nurses and people who look after us when we are ill. We remember everyone who is poorly and ask you to be with them. Amen. As we come together tonight to remember Christians all over the world who are doing the same, we pray that they will find love and peace with your Christmas time. We ask you to be with all Christians everywhere, no matter how hard celebrating Christmas may, may be. And remember all members of clergy helping to guide our celebrations in these difficult times. Amen. Thank you. Thank you for all our family and friends. Thank you for all our family and friends. The people who love us. The people who love us. And look after us. And look after us. Help them to carry on keeping us safe. Carry on to keep it, to looking after us and keeping us safe. And having fun with us. And having fun with us. Now in our crib service, it has been traditional, as one well of our final songs, to sing the Christmas Okie Koki. So we'd really love you to join with us now. If you've never done this before, in the chorus, you will see videos of people doing a Mexican wave. So I know that everybody at home will be doing the Mexican wave as we sing the Christmas Okie Koki. Just how much I love us all. That's why. 
service we wish you a very happy Christmas and may God bless all of you and those who you love in the name of God the Father the Son and the Holy Spirit <laughs> 